Hi, today I want to show you how I use my phone to control the Canon S100 camera. I have uh, loaded the software package HDK version 1.3. I will give you the link in the video description about the details of loading the software to your camera. And here is my setting. I'm using the uh, USB cable connect to my laptop. On my laptop, I'm running the uh, CHDKPTP software. It's an open source software and it allows you to see the live image of the Canon camera. The only modification I have done in this software is I mirror the image so you can see all the text is uh, mirrored and I, I also add some uh, keyboard shortcut for the function keys and I will show you how this work and about all my changes I will put the links in the video description okay now I'm using a very old camera to uh, capture the video because I need my phone for demonstration. Here is my Canon camera which is show, uh, capturing the image of myself. You can see the live image is he over here and it's a mirrored image. I want to show you I can control the camera with my mobile phone and I'm using the uh, multi remote app. It's an Android application and I have to select the server which I already set up everything is ready to go all about the remote control app uh, I've got another video I will put the link uh, in the video description now uh, I only set up four buttons the only thing you have to do is make sure your cursor is set to the command line of the PTP software Otherwise, it won't work. The, the the key shortcut doesn't work. And let's try the. You can see my, the, my live image over there. Let's try the zoom button. Yeah, you can see it's, it's zooming in and zoom out. Okay, and take a shot. Yeah, you can hear there's a click and if I want to record video press the record button here and you can see there's a record sign over here because I have uh, fl flipped the image just for myself to control it's easier to control the mirror image so then the record uh, sign is reversed so I can stop it with the record button again you can see I can control with the smartphone now I'm using my phone to record the video again because I don't need this for remote control I'm going to show you how to use the remote to control the camera the remote can be connected to via Bluetooth to the laptop and uh, what I am using is, is uh, the glove pie and glove pie allowed me to define uh, the V control assigns to the buttons and I have another video showing the glove pie and V mode I will put it in the description and when I start uh, my script my script has only four lines for four buttons when I start the uh, script you can see my remote is activated and now I'm going back to my PTP you can see there's a live uh, image again in order to con use the key control you have to place the cursor into command line now I'm going to try the uh, zoom and press the up button and it's zooming you can see it's zooming in and now button is zooming out 
So it's a um, mirror image. You can see my hand. Uh, my hand is uh, my right, right hand here. So and I can take a photo by pressing the uh, B button. So there's a photo shoot. And if I want the video recording, I press the A button here on top. So press A. And you can see there's a record sign, which is uh, the mirror image. And I use the mirror image for uh, uh, to see myself. OK, now this the another option to control your camera. Uh, this one is not using the Wi-Fi. The other one, the, the uh, mobile app was using the Wi-Fi. So you need to connect your mobile to the same network in order to control your camera but this one is just connect to the bluetooth of your laptop i hope you like this video thank you for watching bye